Hi, my name's Steve Large and I'm a clinical hypnotherapist for Thoughtwave's Hypnotherapy. Um, I'd just like to clear a few myths up about what hypnotherapy is. One of the main things I have with clients or potential clients at the beginning is the worry that can read minds. Now I can't do this. Um, all secrets and stuff like that are locked in your mind and that's where they'll stay and that's not part of my job. My job is to help reprogram your mind, your subconscious. So you'll come to me, we'll have an interview and you'll explain what your perceived problems are, uh, how they affect your life and we'll make a plan together on how we're going to rectify this and create the character that resonates with you, the character that you want to be. So. If you feel like you're very insecure, you don't like crowds, you're, um, you're not very confident in public spaces or in social circles, we can reprogram your mind via hypnotherapy and reprogram your subconscious where this is no longer the case. So if you see yourself being the life and soul of a party or the, the main speaker at an event, this is what we can create for you. Um, I just want to be also clear the fact that you will not do anything while under hypnosis that will go against your moral foundation or how you would normally behave or um, anything that you don't want to do. So I can't make you do anything. All I can do is help assist with your self-talk and your conditioned mind to create the person you want to be, the true you, the better you, the improved you, without all the baggage from the past. So I can help with many things through hypnotherapy. I can help phobias, fears, um, even pre-exam nerves. I can help with smoking, weight loss, low self-esteem. Um, it it's endless, the power of hypnotherapy. I took up being a hypnotherapist because this helped me with a lot of issues that I was dealing with in the past. And I thought this is fantastic. Um, I was a personal trainer and I still am, have been for now over 20 years. I'm also a life coach. I do CBT and NLP um, training. I find all these to be a better way to help. Now, I find this is the case because it's on a positive note. We work for solutions in a positive way, opposed to digging up the past and focusing on why we feel this way, opposed to do we need to feel this way any longer. And if the answer is we don't need to feel this way any longer, then we let go. We let go and we move on to the future that we deserve and the future that we see. This is all done by putting you into a trance state. Now, all a trance state is, is a deep relaxation. You're not quite asleep, you're not quite awake. We pass through trance states twice a day at least. So it's the state between being asleep and waking up and it's also the state between being awake and going to sleep. This in the middle phase is the trance phase. We also, I think it's estimated, go into trance about 120 times a day. Now this is done when you're driving your car on, say, autopilot. This is a trance state. When you're washing the dishes, when you're watching a movie. Any states like this where you're totally engrossed and you're no longer in thought, these are trance states. So this is all hypnotherapy is. We put you into a trance state and relax you, which feels fantastic. Um, and we reprogram your mind. Now, I've got a little drawing here, which I was given on the course I did, and I think this is a fantastic way to explain it. So, if you can see here, we've got the subconscious mind and the conscious mind. Now, the subconscious mind is where all the data is stored. So it's like a computer. This is your hard drive and this is your Google search. So we program our subconscious mind with all the facts. So uh, a way of explaining it is 
when we're younger, normally up to the age of seven, we have got a mind like a sponge. So everything we're taught and told, we store straight away without question because we've not developed our conscious mind, our critical thinking yet. So if we're told an apple's an apple, we just eat the apple and we take it as, a, as an apple without question because we've got no critical thinking. We store that information. And this goes through a lot of stuff throughout life. So we keep storing stuff. We also store trauma. So we have trauma stored in our subconscious and then we have triggers. These triggers are brought on by events, scents, like a smell. Um, it could be in numerous things. So these will trigger certain emotions in us, certain fears, certain phobias, certain behaviours are built in on these triggers that are built up via our subconscious and what's been programmed normally in an earlier age before the age of seven. So what we do is to get into the mind, the subconscious to reprogram these triggers and stuff like that, we have to, to quiet the conscious mind. We do this through the hypnotherapy. We quieten that down in a trance state. We take this out and we can reprogram it. So next time you have a trigger that comes up and something like a phobia, like you're going on a plane and you're like, oh, plane, you look in your, uh, your subconscious and you're like, see planes crashing, falling, whatever else that you've got stored in your subconscious that makes you feel fear towards flying. We reprogram that because danger is very real. Fear isn't. Fear is perception. Danger is real. So there's always a danger element in anything in life. But to be scared of living doesn't make sense. We need to be able to live our life. So we can reprogram our, our mind to take away these triggers of fear. Now, all this is such an easy, relaxing, beautiful process. For me, it's a fantastic way of having therapy. Now, I know there's a lot of myths um, surrounding what hypnosis is and isn't. I know all the stage hypnotherapy about bark like a chicken and dance like a dog and all that type of stuff is out there. And that's fine for entertainment. Um, but this, this has got pure beneficial um, ways to help you improve your life, to change your life for the better. So you can become the person you deserve to be, the person you see yourself as, and I can help you achieve this. Now, I hope this has cleared a lot of stuff up, and feel free to look at my website. It's www.thoughtwaveshypnotherapy.co.nz or my Facebook page, which is Thoughtwaves Hypnotherapy, or even follow some of my YouTube videos, um, Steve Large, and just get a feel about what I'm about. I'm here to help and guide and help people be the true selves and to have a happy, hopeful and fulfilling life, free of mind-based fears, phobias and old thought patterns and behaviours. Anyway, I hope this has helped and it's, it's shown you that you don't have to keep suffering. You don't have to keep suffering with um, negative thought patterns. You don't have to keep suffering with negative self-talk. You don't have to spend the rest of your life feeling bad. You can wake up feeling fantastic, feeling great, and you can start that today. So if anything I've said interests you or you want to know more, please feel free to contact me. I'm here to help. I'm here to talk. Enjoy your day, evening, morning, wherever you are. And I hope this video has resonated with you a little bit. Thank you.